for the insurance market in Christchurch? Uh, yes, because it means that the uh, 4,000 policyholders uh, that, that AMI currently have are seen as a valuable resource for insurers. Insurers would not be buying uh, uh, the opportunity to keep policyholders here if they had no interest in the future here. So it is a very positive sign. Have you had any talks with any potential bidders for AMI? Are you aware of those? No, there's a process bidders? that's in place and, and uh, the government will get reports in due course. Is it, they're putting it sort of officially on the block this week, Goldman Sachs? Well, uh, you know, as I say, there's a process in place and the government will get advice in due course. And you think AMI is sellable though, in its current state? Well, clearly it is. There's uh, a lot of people who are interested in it. You see the GP that the Crown has uh, got with AMI essentially short circuit the whole issue of demutualisation. Well, the, the, the mutual obligations to the policyholders meant that they're liable for the entire debt, so I don't anticipate too much problem if there's a solution to uh, what could be a very big bill for some people. Clearly, that's not a palatable situation. Well, the government's going to pick up that bill, though. Uh, well, it's been, well, the discussions are ongoing. Okay.